it's our second year in the defense. Um, last year, I think we were thinking a little too much at the beginning of the season, and it kind of slowed us down on the field. This year, we can just go. Um, do what we need to do within the defense and just kind of let loose. Just having another year under our belt, the defense is going to help us tremendously just on reacting to the ball, just different types of things like that. I mean, last year I was learning. This year I'm just kind of sharpening up and uh, seeing what more I can do to take my game to the next level. Offensive, they, they've, they've developed more leaders, and I think on the defensive side of the ball we have a lot of leaders too. So I guess it just basically bring everything together this year. And special teams is important. People don't understand how important special teams is. So if we can get every guy, every guy to come on board, we'll be great. We know the scheme, and uh, we know what each guy needs to do within the scheme. So there's just a confidence about us. We want to go out there and prove ourselves again. And um, last year was, was done. Now we got to reprove. Our, we got to re, um, dominate again. I don't think I don't think age matters at all. Okay. I think I started. I think I started kind of when I was my sophomore year when I when I was playing as hard as I could. I think that kind of started my leadership role. So I don't think age matters. Like Quandre is a leader, and he's a freshman last year. Quandre might have been. He's a ball, he won the Ball Hawk Award as a freshman, so I don't think it has anything to do with age. And you gotta you gain confidence through seeing other guys work. People don't want to hear you talk, people want to see you work. That's what I try to do. I think I can just be a better leader and um, and just be, I don't know, just be the backbone of the defense. You know, all we gotta do is manage this game. We This is Texas and we have athletes all the time. And it's not like we've been down with athletes. I think for a while we just couldn't find out how to use all of them. We have weapons. We've got a great team around us. And if you ask most quarterbacks, um, they say, you know, well, the reason I'm good is really because I've got some guys I can just get the ball to. When it was a quarterback, all you have to do is delegate who gets the ball. And they do the rest. Um, that makes that makes it a lot of fun. we got unbelievable running backs. we got awesome receivers. We have young guys that are trying to come in and play right now that you know, all we got to do is just manage the game, whoever's in the game. Well, some of it's mental and some of it is just uh, an understanding of how college football works. It's not like high school. In high school, you know, it didn't matter what coverage you're in. I could fit it in any hole you wanted, but it's faster and you got to be careful with the ball a little bit more. I think my leadership, uh, my leadership puts me above a lot. I think that's something that my brother had as well and, and a lot of quarterbacks that play the game thrive on that. And, but to an extent, I don't want that to be all that I, all that I'm good at. I don't want to be well. I'm a leader, but I can't go do this. You know, I got I got You can lead all you want. You can talk and, and be the example all you want. But until you can go out of the field and play the game and be a great quarterback, leadership doesn't doesn't go so far. So I want to be able to mesh both those and, and be able to make it a full package.